Yeah. Uh, oh, look at that. It's your RV vibrating. Close by, we can put it in there. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it is pretty good. Oh my. For you, you've got the front chairs that swivel around. You can just replace it with that. Yeah, there you go. Well, I got really lucky today. My my uh, piece of crap Kenwood stereo that was in here. It was just a cheap, cheap one. The new one that I've had in here for months waiting to install. Holy cow, it's windy today. Is also Kenwood. And the, um, the plugs are perfect. They line right up and I didn't, I didn't have to change anything because so I was just plug and play. But we have to cut this a little bit to fit the new stereo because of this uh, dash cover. So there's my new babies right there in there. Nice big speakers. Eh? They're actually meant for the roof, the patio speakers. And instead of putting them on the roof like I originally planned, uh, I figured, geez, why not kill two birds with one stone? Instead of having to have um, extra speakers on the roof, the ones that I had on the roof in here were crap, those little ones. So I um, tapped into the wires from those guys right there and uh, managed to get the wire through the cabinet down in there, running through the cabinet, and then drilled a hole right through for the speakers right here. Anyways, so these are now my, my rear speakers connected to the new front stereo. Um, but they're, yes, they're outdoor speakers for a patio. Um, and I was gonna put them on the roof like I did with a previous vehicle you guys saw last year. However, that means I would have had to go get another one of those speaker selector switches and have, uh, you know, turn off inside speakers to turn on the outside speakers. And um, I wanted to do something about the inside as well. So I thought, geez, why don't I just put them inside? Because they swivel on these mounts. So we cut the valances, as you can see, cut the valances on both sides. Okay. And now all you got to do is loosen these. They flip down. I'll try to do this with one hand. But you can see here, they lock in. And you tighten it up, and now you have outside speakers when you're sitting outside. It is perfect, the perfect angle. Uh, the other issue with putting them up on the roof is when the awning is out, you're kind of blocking a lot of the sound. So this way, the uh, sound is underneath the awning. And of course, I have the option, sometimes I'm camped or I'm parked on the, or I'm sitting on the other side with friends. We want music on the other side. So do the same thing there. I can just flip the speaker outside. And there you go. You got outside speakers, even though they're mounted inside. The speaker's right there. And my phone controlling. Perfect. So I have patio speakers, stealth speakers. Perfect. And these things absolutely rock. Uh, they have built-in uh, subwoofers in them too, so they put out a nice, nice, really nice uh, deep bass, good sound. Not your average tinny outside speakers. These things are awesome. So there you go. Geez, I got a lot of speakers in here now. I got the surround sound system for the TV, plus this. <laughs> I'm tall. Don't hit your head on them. Perfect. Meow. Yeah. See, now I can be totally immature and I can 
swivel the speaker outside, open the window. I can drive around and I can do stuff like this when people walk by. So mature, eh? Now you guys remember this from last year. I can uh, flip both of them out, uh, facing outside, open both windows, and drive down the street and just hit this button. <laughs> okay, so. Uh, the speakers and the stereo, as a matter of fact, which I bought like six months ago and I showed you guys on a video, the Kenwood Exelon, I bought at Visions, so there's lots of locations everywhere. Visions.ca, of course, if you want to check out the stuff, but uh, they had way more selection than Best Buy, and of course they always seem to have it in stock at Visions. And they're Canadian, so I'm supporting a Canadian company, so I always try to buy my electronics at Visions. So there you go. There's some pretty rad indoor speakers, and they turn into outdoor speakers all you got to do is swivel them it's pretty sweet what do you think kitty meow yeah <laughs> keep on rocking the free world everyone yeah yeah In the free world. Yo, it's Crazy Clay. Hey, I'm here to say RV life all the way. 99 problems, but a mortgage ain't one. Look at me, I'm having so much fun. Cause Kimberly burns all his wood like no other one could. Rolling, rolling in his BT cruiser all through Vancouver. He is a master YouTuber. Down by the river cooking up a steak. He's so excited, he makes his eyes shake. Keep on rocking in the free world. You're an inspiration to us all, unless you're skiing and you fall. Home is where you park. There's purple neon shining in the dark. Freedom unplugged, no earthquake can scare. Maybe just a big ass grizzly bear. Keep on rocking in the free world. My boy Justin cruising around the city with little Emmy, his little kitty. Vancouver and Toronto, we are a team. You know what I mean? So don't forget to subscribe so Justin and I can keep our channels alive. Degrees Fahrenheit is 30 kilometers an hour. How many <laughs> gallons in a liter? Celsius. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>